Now Kane goes with a short right to the head and then a jab. Hard ah, right hand by Mahanga. Kane just got his chin far enough out of the way, otherwise he was going to be down for the count of ten. Left hook that time by Mahanga, high on the head of Kane. And Kane looks as though he's in for a bad fifth round. He's hurt that time by Mahanga. Comes in close and clinches with the New Zealander. Left hand lead now by Kane. Nice big left hand by uh, Kane. But Mahanga lets that left hook whistle across again. Kane backs off, comes back with a neat left hook. He made Mahanga miss with the right hand and then hooked him with the left hand. Left hand jabbed out by Mahanga. Mahanga using the left hand himself. Mahanga jabbing up with the left hand. Look at the shoulders on Kahu Mahanga. It's easy to see where that punching power comes from. Left to the head now by uh, the Englishman. Left hook to the head. Look at uh, Kane. Down with the left hook and then down with the right to the head. Reprimand from referee Terry Riley. A left hand jab. Right to the head now by Mahanga, and Mahanga getting in close. A bit of a clash of heads then, too, in this fifth round. Left hand jab, left hook to the head now. Mahanga's pushed away, he's coming back now. Left hand jab now by Kane, left hand jab once again by Kane. Neat left hand punching. He's a neat boxer, Kane. A right to the head by uh, Mahanga. A neat boxer, Kane, and had an explosive, destructive puncher, Mahanga. Right to the head now by uh, Mahanga, and he gets in close as the bell goes for the end of round five. Here we go now, for round six. Uh, the Englishman Kane won the last round. He outboxed Mahanga. Mahanga's still not out crazy. Only had a go with his left hand in one part of that round. He's starting off now well. He'll have to keep it up all the time. That's good stuff. It's the neat, pretty boxing of uh, Mick Kane from England, fighting the explosive, punching power of Kahu Mahanga from New Zealand. And the, and the jab and parry of the left hand of uh, Mick Kane, the chubby chappy from England. Listen, you're, you're this chubby chappy business. You're one of your mother. My mother, look at him. I thought you were a bit with him. Yes. <laughs> but I don't know, those... <laughs> Those New Zealand muscles look pretty frightening, don't they? <laughs> left hook to the head now by uh, by uh, Kane as he gets in close. Left hook to the head and a right to the head now by Mahanga. And that hurt Kane. Kane is definitely hurt. But Gamely backs up with a left hand jab. Left hand jab now. Mahanga's leading from too far away. He stepped in good at the left hook, but he's got to get in closer. Oh, well, that's a good punch. beautiful left hook by Mahanga and then a short right hand <laughs> by uh, Kane. Left hand jab now oh. by uh, Mick Kane. My golly, the East End kid from London uh, is showing some courage. He's taken some terrific punches from Mahanga and he's got in there. Boxing as well as he can. Left hand lead and a right to the head. Mahanga lets a big one go and Kane beats him to the move with a left hand jab. A fight that's packed full of interest. Left into the body now by Kane. A right to the head now by Kane. A left hand jab by, uh, by Kane. Left hand jab. He's worrying, Kane is worrying the Howdy boy right out of his fight. Sneaking him open. A right to the head now by Mahanga and Kane Gadl gamely. Hits him with a left hand jab. Oh, there was a nasty hook. Beautiful punch by Mahanga. He let that one go. Right to the head now by Kane. He's trying to box Mahanga away. Left hand jab by Kane. A jab by Kane. Listen to the crowd applause. A great fighting round by both of them. The bell for the end of round six. We come now for round seven. And, uh, Kane, the Englishman, has taken the fight off Mahanga. Took it off him again that time. Although Mahanga did do better, but Kane came back and outboxed him. And uh, he's just picking his, picking his way and sneaking the points. While Mahanga's waiting for that one big punch, leading from too far away. Ah, right over the body by Mahanga. You can hear that punch that home. Rose and Rose back. And the crowd now rallying uh, to the support of uh, Mick Kane as he's gamely standing up against the thumping punches of Kahu Mahanga. And coming back with a left hand. Then a left to the head by, uh, uh, by Mahanga. I want to see the way that Kane is gaining confidence. He goes along. Beautiful left hand punches by Mick Kane. Look to the body and look to the head. Mahanga comes back with a hook. And then a right to the head. Left and right now by Mick Kane. A right to the head by, by Mick Kane. And a beautiful left hook by Kahu. A jab now by Mahanga, by uh, Kane, right to the head by Mahanga, left hook now by Mick Kane. Mahanga's bleeding very freely from the nose. Ample evidence of the accurate left hand punching of the Londoner, Mick Kane. 
Left and right for the head now by Kane on a jab by Mahanga. Left hand jab now by Kane. Kane comes in. Left hand jab now by Kane. Right to the head by uh, by Kane. Left hook now by Kane. Jab by Kane. Beautiful left hand by Kane. Right to the head by Kane. Left hook by Kane. And this is the seventh round. A left hook by, uh, by uh, Kane and a right by Mahanga. Left hook now by Kane. Mahanga tried to hold on and Kane gets away out of there. Left hand lead by, uh, by Kane. Look at him stand up and deliver that left hand jab in puppy book style. A right to the head now uh, by Kane. And Mahanga fights back with a desperation left hook. Right to the head now by Mahanga. But screaming from the New Zealand at home. As the bell goes for the end of round seven. The anticipation of uh, Kane since Mahanga slowed down just a little is, is very pretty. He's made a few boo boos, but by Joe, he's made some of those big punching, those big punches there, but not that one. Right on the chin from Mahanga, right to the head. But look at Kane get in there for protection. Mahanga coming back now. A left hand jab now by Mahanga. Jab by Mahanga. A left hook to the head now by uh, Kane. Kane is an economical fighter, Ron. He's a neat, precise one. Very neat. Beautiful jabbing and a short, jolting right hand to the head. He goes into Mahanga and confidently goes for an uppercut. This could be a dangerous move. A left hand lead now by uh, Mahanga and a jab by Kane. A right to the head by Kane and a smashing right hand by Mahanga. Kane claims him very quickly. Mahanga now throws desperation punches by Mahanga. And Kane grabs him and pitches. A left hook and a right to the head by Mahanga. Missed for the left hook and Kane jabs him neatly with a left hand. This is boxing deluxe now. Beautiful boxing by Kane, but it's smashing right to the head. And by Mahanga, he's hurt Kane. We'll see that one on replay. A smashing right to the head. Look at Mahanga going in again now. Left hook. Scoring the fight. It's a tough one. How are you scoring it at home? 
and there's Mick Kane, the boy from the East End of London, who's won the hearts of all uh, Australian sports fans, whether they've been at actual ringside here tonight or whether they've been watching at TV ringside, because it looked as though he was going to be bombed out in the first round, and by golly, he's gamely come back and made one of the really great was, lights on TV on ringside for us. He was bombed out of the end of the eighth. He was gone. Gone. He was done like a good dinner. And he came back in the last round and then he's out boxed again. He's shown terrific courage. He's taken three times as much as what Mahanga has taken. Mahanga is game, but he hasn't taken the point. Last, last round. Here they go now. And a genuine touch of the gloves. And away they go. Tahu Mahanga letting them go now to try and win the fight. Left and right to the head. Right to the body by Mahanga. Left hook now by, uh, by uh, Smith Payne. And right to the head by Mahanga. Payne back to the left hand side. Left and left and left. The head to the right hand from Mick Payne. Left into the body by Kane, and the right to the head by Kane. Left hand jab by Mick Payne. Mahinga moving up. A left hook by uh, Kane. A right to the head by Mahinga. Left hook by Mahinga. A right to the body now by Kane. Mahinga goes with a right and close once again. A left hand jab by Kane. He stabbed that one right under Mahinga's nose. Right to the head by Kane. A right by Mahinga. Punch for punch and proves the move as the second run out. Close to the referee's decision, a crashing right hand by Mahinga. A left hook now by Kane. Left hook by Kane again. Right hand now. A minute to go in the fight. One minute to the referee's decision, and Kane is holding on. First time he's really desperately held on. Left hand jab by Kane. A jab by Mahinga. Right to the head now. And by Kane. Kane's very tired. The punches are really hurting now. Mahinga. Closing on him again, but misses with the right hand. I think Mahanga too is tired. Still bleeding freely from the nose. Left hook by Kane. Jab by Mahanga. A right into the body by Kane. A left hook now by Kane. Left hook by Mahanga. Half a minute to go. A right to the body by Kane. Left hook by Mahanga. And the referee gets them apart once again. Left jab now by Kane. Mahanga holding on the clinch. They break away again. Right hand by Mahanga, Kane jabbing, left hook, left hook by, uh, by uh, Kane. Mahanga comes in, here comes the decision as they get close together, a left hand by Kane and a swinging right from Mahanga. Shaking hands, Kahu Mahanga walking across the ring. A real thrill of Kahu from start to finish. A tough fight. Yeah, I know. I thought he went on points. Yeah. Yeah. You really thought that he had the points on you? Yeah. I didn't feel that it was hot. No, it was a bit hot. You didn't use that left hand as straight as you've seen you use it? No, before. I didn't feel 100% hot. How would you feel about fighting him again? Oh, I wouldn't mind. Would you come back from New Zealand and fight him again? Oh, yes. 